White blood cells leukocytes are a crucial a part of the body's defense against infectious organisms and foreign substances the immune system. The amount of white blood cells white cell count is generally but 11,000 cells per microliter of blood 11 times 109 per liters. The most common explanation for a rise within the white blood corpuscle count is. The normal response of the body to an infection other causes include. Certain drugs, like corticosteroids cancers of the bone marrow, such as leukemia, release of immature or abnormal white blood cells from the bone marrow into the blood There are many sorts of white blood corpuscle, see overview of white blood corpuscle disorders, and every type could also be increased. However, most ordinarily, people have an increase in neutrophils increase in lymphocytes A high white blood corpuscle count may indicate that the system is functioning to destroy an infection. It may even be a symbol of physical or emotional stress. People with particular blood cancers can also have high white blood cells counts. A low white blood corpuscle count can signal that an injury or condition is destroying cells faster than they're being made, or that the body is producing too few of them. White blood cells structure around 1% of all blood cells, and that they are essential to regular function within the system. White blood cells also are referred to as leukocytes. The bone marrow continuously produces white blood cells. They're stored within the blood and lymphatic systems until they're necessary for fighting an infection or disease within the body. Several sorts of white blood corpuscles serve different functions. Most people will produce around 100 billion white blood cells a day. There are normally between 4,000 and 11,000 cells in every microliter of blood, although this will vary consistent with race. There are several differing types of white blood cells, each with varying responsibilities. Lymphocytes, these are vital for producing antibodies that help the body to defend itself against bacteria, viruses, and other threats. Neutrophils, these are powerful white blood cells that destroy bacteria and fungi. Basophils, these alert the body to infections by secreting chemicals into the bloodstream, mostly to combat allergies. Eosinophils, these are liable for destroying parasites and cancer cells, and that they are a part of an allergic response monocytes, these are liable for attacking and breaking down germs or bacteria that enter the body. When necessary, monocytes visit other organs, like the spleen, liver, lungs, and bone marrow, where they transform into a cell called a macrophage. A macrophage is liable for many functions, including removing dead or damaged tissue, destroying cancer cells, and regulating the immune reaction. Causes an increase in white blood cells is understood as leukocytosis. It typically occurs in response to the subsequent conditions. Infection immunosuppression medications, including corticosteroids a bone marrow or immune disorder certain cancers, like acute or chronic leukemia inflammation injury emotional stress labor pregnancy smoking allergic reactions excessive exercise certain respiratory illnesses, like a pertussis or tuberculosis, may cause the amount of white blood cells to extend. In some cases, all white blood cells are affected. However, some people have a selected disease during which just one sort of white blood corpuscle is affected. If levels of one particular sort of white blood corpuscle increase, this might flow from to a selected trigger. Monocytes, high levels of monocytes may indicate the presence of chronic infection, an autoimmune or blood disease, cancer, or other medical conditions. Lymphocytes, if there's an elevation within the level of lymphocytes, the condition is understood as lymphocytic leukocytosis. This might occur as a result of an epidemic or an infection, like tuberculosis. It's going to even be linked to specific lymphomas and leukemias. Neutrophils, increased levels of neutrophils in their body cause a physical state referred to as neutrophilic leukocytosis. This condition may be a normal immune reaction to an occasion, like infection, injury, inflammation, some medications, and certain sorts of leukemia. Basophils, rising levels of basophils may occur in people with a history of underactive thyroid disease, referred to as hypothyroidism, or as a result of certain other medical conditions. Eosinophils, if an individual registers high levels of eosinophils, the body could be reacting to a parasitic infection, allergen, or asthma. There is, once in a while, no identifiable cause for the rise in white blood cells. This is often referred to as idiopathic hyperiosinophilic syndrome. It can cause serious complications, like damage to the guts, lung, liver, skin, and systema nervosum. Those suffering from idiopathic hyperiosinophilic syndrome may experience symptoms such as 
Weight loss fevers night sweats fatigue coughing chest pain swelling stomach ache skin rash pain weakness confusion coma total words 730. I hope you are enjoyed watching this video about health issues. Comments, likes and share. Subscribe to our channel and learn more about new things. If you have any problem related to health then you will contact health issue page.